Hi folks, Florida Trailblazer here, exploring at Noonan's Lake Conservation Area. It's located in Alachua County, and long ago, there was a lot of turpentine history in this area. It was once a very large industry in Florida. In fact, it was Florida's largest industry at one time going back to the 1800s and into the early 1900s. It's part of an old shovel here. Starting to see some remains from the turpentine industry out here. And here are some hurdy cup fragments. And these are pieces from a hurdy cup which is what they used to get the sap and resin from the pine trees. So I'm going to keep looking around, see if I can discover more out here. It's a cat face tree. More remnants from the turbotine industry. You can see the markings right here in the tree, the V-shaped markings. And there's a couple nails attached to it. And this was an old pine tree that was tapped for sap and resin. They would attach their hurdy cups to these trees. Seen a lot of cat faces in the area. This one's on the ground and it has the metal gutters attached to it still. Here's a cat face tree and there's remains of a hurdy cup there at the base of it. Take a look at these hurdy cups. These are more intact. You can see there's a hole in one of them. That's where they would attach it to the tree. Over here on the ground is a fully intact hurdy cup. This is really nice to see because most of the time, you can only find pieces from these cups. And it can be rare to find one like this, so... Really amazing to see this out here after all these years.
You get a nice view of the tram here. And you would have had multiple layers of history in this area. Besides turpentine, there would have been logging operations as well. So this tram was probably used by logging industry, but also could have been used by the turpentine industry as well. And this tram just goes deep into the swamps. I've been out here for a long while exploring the wilderness and seeing a lot of herdy cups and catfish trees, traces from the past. And it's really fascinating to be able to still experience this kind of history in these areas. I truly value the time and opportunity that I get to share this kind of stuff with you. I feel it's very important because more and more parts of old Florida are disappearing. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I do appreciate you watching. Thank you very much.